So once again, race fans, Gary loved Fairbury American Legion Speed to everything about it. The fans, the food, the track itself, but mostly the racing. He knew it would never be an easy night if he was going to win, and that's why he loved to race here. He called Fairbury American Legion Speedway his home track. If he won a race, it was because he had to battle hard to come out on top and make a good show for the fans just to get there. If he didn't win, he knew it was a good, hard-fought battle that everyone would enjoy. Nothing made him happier than battling door-to-door -door as fast as he could with some of the best here at the Legion Speedway. There was mutual respect between him and the other drivers, and he enjoyed a hard-fought, close day. Always happy to be greeted by the fans after and enjoyed a hard-fought, close race. Ladies and gentlemen, he would fight for himself, his family, his fans, and everyone who enjoy close racing to try to be the best. He fought cancer with some of the with the same determination time after time it would return and he would and push back on his feet and not let him beat again he showed us all what it takes to be a champion in his life and in the end the cancer won but it never stopped Gary Cook Jr. from living life to the fullest making the most of every day and as always showing his family friends fans and everybody who knew him that win or lose, you have to keep fighting. Ladies and gentlemen, the missing man formation in honor of our friend, our racer, Mr. Gary Cook Jr. Gonna be a great battle here tonight. Matt Mever, Jay Ledford. Last night's winner, Jacob Poole and Lance Dane, 30 times at Gary Cook Jr. Memorial is underway. Matt Mevert on the inside. Jay Ledford going to rock it down the back stretch and take the lead. Last week's week feature winner here at Fairbury Speedway was Jay Ledford. Mever going to show his nose to the inside. Good battle side by side down the front straightaway. Ledford on the top side, Mever going to slide up behind him. Jake Poole going to try to work the inside, so it'll be Ledford, Mever, Dame, and Poole. Brooks now going to dive to the inside. We'll see if we get to that inside row cooking. It'll be Ledford showing away. Two and a book, 28 to go here early on. Jake Poole now trying to roll Mever to the inside. Mever to hold him off. Poole's third. For the B Lance Dame, now Mever again will drop back to the inside. Jay Ledford on the outside, Ledford Poole. Or excuse me, Ledford Mebert. Lance Dame and Jacob Poole, your top four. Lance Dame now shot out of a cannon again down the back straightaway. Mebert gives him room, so Dame to second. A power move to second. Here comes Lance Dame, and it'll be Kesson Darji power to second. Mebert back to third. Poole fourth. Brooks fifth. Sixth to be Kinder. Seventh to be Jeff Friedman. Eighth. It'll be TD Berger. Ninth. That is young Cohen Breed in tenth. Jeff Curl. Cars working a high side. We got our first caution of the evening. Rounds for 32 Z Nate Zimmer. Yeah. Up on the Grizz Memorial scoreboard. Jay Ledford showing away Dame now to his inside. He waits for Ledford to fire. They do. Here we go. Oh, Dame with a good restart there on the bottom. Mever going to try to roll him on the top. Here comes Matt Mevert around the outside of Lance Dane. Now Dame going to work to the inside. And in because of Darji Power, D1. We'll see if he can pedal it. Remain in second, he will. Mevert right there. Jake Poole, Chad Kinder, Jeff Friedman all on the bottom now. We'll see if Dame can get her going on the bottom. Mevert trying to roll him on a high side. Go battle for a second. All of a sudden, Jake Poole going to work right in the middle of the speedway over there in turn three and four. Here comes Jake Poole now. Matt Mevert in 22, trying to roll D1 on Lance Dave side by side as they work down the back straightaway. Action hot and heavy behind them. Jake Poole, the lone duck, working right in the middle of the speedway. Here comes Jacob Poole again. It'll be Dame, Poole, Mevert, Ledford. Four cars under a blanket here in the Gary Cook Jr. Memorial. Here comes Lance Dave side by side. Good battle for the lead. Mevert and Poole might have found something in the middle. Three wide for the lead. 22 remain. Great battle up front. Lance Dame now showing away. Oh, a dandy again here at Falls. Mevert will slide up in front of Ledford's having none of it. They'll go back around Matt Mevert in, in 22. Jake Poole right there. Lance Dame going to take the lead on the bottom three wide for a second. 
Oh, great race in action. Jay Ledford to second, pool third, Mever back to fourth. Mever to retake third, now gonna go with a two for one, deal down the back straight away. No contact with the seven, Ella Jay Ledford, Mever back to second, Ledford third, pool fourth, Brooks fifth. Good racing action, Mever to second, Ledford third, pool fourth, Brooks fifth. Jeff Friedman sixth, Jeff Leka seventh. Eighth will be Chad Kinder, ninth TD Berger, 10th Jeff Curl, 11th Jim Ferris. 19 remain, Dane in the front of the pack. Lance Damon, Matt Mever, here comes Mever in 22. Three car lengths behind the knee one of Lance Dame. Jacob Poole now in 7 L. J. Ledford gonna battle side by side. Poole gonna slide up in front of Ledford. Ledford will show his displeasure. Matt Mever trying to run down. D1 to Lance Dane. Pulling out a third. Ledford back to fourth. Ledford now going to try the inside. Here comes Matt Mever in 22. Kitty was part of this great battle in September at 2013 with his American Modified Series of Steel Bill, Illinois driver. That bandit, Mark Bush race car. Going to work to the high side. Lance Dane to the inside. Drag race off of four. Half a car leg. 16 remain. One shy of halfway. Matt Mevert gonna look for the lead down the back straightaway. Dame noses ahead, side by side. Lap traffic approaching for your race leaders. Lance Dame and Matt Mevert off turn number four. Give it back to Lance Dame. Halfway home. Side by side battle at the front. Lance Dame and Matt Mevert. Good racing action again here tonight at the Legion Speedway. Jacob Poole, third, Jay Ledford, fourth, Stephen Brooks, fifth. Lance Damon, Matt Mavert, side by side, lap after lap. 14 to go. Mavert gonna edge ahead down the back stretch. Mavert now showing away. Dame back to second. 13 remain, Matt Mavert to the lead. Lance Dame second, Jay Ledford to Jake Poole. Ledford gives him room. Oh, we got a caution. 96 in. Mike McKinney stopped at the top of turn two. Well, with 17 in, 13 to go in the Grizz Memorial scoreboard. McKinney stopped the top of turn two. What a battle up front, Matt Mavert. Pick a favorite to cheer him on. 13 remain, $2,064 a week. Here are the Gary Cook Jr. Seventh stop for the American Modified Series. We're back in our way. Ah, oh, quickly three wide. Steven Brooks will drive to the inside of seven. LJ Ledford. Jake Poole third. Ledford fourth. Brooks fifth. Action. Pick it up. Three wide behind your leaders. Oh, my. Mever. Dame. Here comes Jacob Poole. Poole and Lance Dame. Here goes Jacob Poole to the high side of Dame. He's going to go by. Dame trying to get to the high side. Poole goes by. So Poole to second. Dame to third. Ledford fourth, Brooks to the inside. That high side might have some momentum. Dame to the outside of Ledford. Ledford will let him go by. So all of a sudden that top side comes to life. It'll be Matt Mever, Jake Poole, Lance Dame, Jay Ledford. Ledford gonna try in the middle of the speedway. Dame slips up just a bit. Ledford can't take advantage. Brooks right there, comes Jeff Lika. So it'll be Mever, Jake Poole, Lance Dame, Jay Ledford, Stephen Brooks, and Jeff Lika side by side. Dame slips up. Ledford goes by. Jeff Lika and Lance Dame. As we got to bring the top of turn at number two, we're going to stand her green as Mever still leads Jake Poole second. Matt Mever, Jake Poole, run one, two, Ledford, third, Brooks, fourth. Mever, Poole, Ledford, Brooks, Ferris, what a run here tonight. Ferris to fifth. Jeff Leak and Jim Ferris, how about Jimmy Ferris in 69? What a run for him here tonight. Mever trying to hold off Poole, now six to go. And Jake Poole run down Matt Mevert in 22. Five to go this time by. We got a car stop. Chad Kinder, the top of turn number one. Kasha now. Oh my, what a race here, the Gary Cook Jr. Memorial.
Six laps remain, $2,064 on the line for the Gary Cook Jr. Memorial here at the Legion Speedway. You see the firing they're going to. Here we go, green flag, we're backing away. See if Poole can find some traction there in the inside. Never gonna rock it by him on down the back straightaway. Never Poole gonna follow him. High Brooks, here comes Ledford. They're gonna make it three wide for that second spot. Poole gonna hold on. Here comes Brooks to third. Ledford fourth. Five to go. Here comes Jeff Leak along with Stephen Brooks. They're gonna go after seven dollar Jay Ledford. And the Borowski power rocket by Roman. Five get it done here tonight. He'll drive to the inside of Ledford. Now gonna go after Jacob Poole. So Stephen Brooks coming to life. Meanwhile, behind them a good battle land. Damon, Jim Ferris. Dave slips up. Ferris will go by. So Ferris to sixth. Fifth Lika. Fourth. Brooks. Third Ledford. Second. Poole. Oh, Medford slips up. Jacob Poole goes by. Are you kidding me? Matt Medford slips up with three to go. He had it in a bag. He slips up. Jacob Poole goes by. So Poole to lead. He rockets away. Never did the wall down the front straightaway. We'll stay green. Something might be wrong with the 22 of Matt Mever. Jacob Poole pulling away down the back stretch. Seven car lengths. White flag in the, in the air. One to go from Jim Winnington. Quarter mile here at the Gary Cook Jr. Memorial. He won Wednesday night at Terre Haute. He won $1,500 at the Farmer City Raceway. The Spring Lake Michigan 82. Jacob Poole wins the first annual Gary Cook Jr. Memorial. Mever second, Ledford third, Brooks fourth, Leka fifth, Dame six, McKinney seventh, Friedman eighth, Jimmy Ferris ninth, Corey Schwingle a good run comes home 10th. Year winner 82, Jacob Poole. Well, I tell you what, race fans, the first annual Gary Cook Jr. Memorial goes to 82, Jacob Poole. Again at Terre Haute, he was a feature winner Wednesday night, Friday at Farmer City. He wins here tonight in the Legion Speedway, Jacob Poole! <laughs> well, I tell you what, Jacob, you guys battled hard early on. I didn't know if it was going to be the low side, the top side. You found your mark on the top side. You and Matt were running a good hard race. He slipped up. You went by $2,064. As you remember, Eric Jr. here tonight. Congratulations. Man, I tell you, I'm just so blessed. And, uh, uh, just to be here for a Gary race. And I just, I've went to a couple of them now. And just uh, in memory of Gary, man, what a race. You guys uh, worked on that track for a little while. And I really thought it was just going to be on the bottom. But, man, we got out there. We were just dicing it up. And, Everybody was running pretty clean, and uh, man, uh, it got a little tight a couple of times, but that's just racing, and uh, Matt grabbed the cushion over there. He had the car to beat, that's for sure, uh, but he, he slipped up on the cushion there, and uh, I was there to take advantage of it. Well, hell of a job here tonight, Wednesday night, Friday night, Saturday night. You still got Sunday, maybe Monday. Congrats. Yeah, at least tomorrow. I want to go home and see my kids. Ah, great job. Congratulations. How about an 82, Jacob Poole? Again, Gary Cook Sr. down here with his family. Again, friends of Gary Cook Jr. They're going right, to move in here. How about a nice round of applause? Family and friends of Gary Cook Jr. as well. Gary's father down here. Give them a round of applause. Thank them for being here. Awesome to see those orange 64 shirts as we remember the Gary Cook Jr. What a race.